Sarah, and I'm here today to make out with Beetlejuice for breast implants. Now, what, Sarah, why did you want, why do you want breast implants so bad? Um, well, I'm a dancer, and I think I'd make more money with bigger breasts. And I've, I just want bigger breasts. I always wanted bigger breasts. Now, have you ever seen Beetlejuice before? Yes. Now, who came up with the idea to kiss him for breasts? Um, my sister, uh, her husband actually told me that would be like a good suggestion. So like I wrote in and that's what I said and that's what I'm ending up doing. Now, uh, I mean, you've seen Beetlejuice before. Yes. What do you think about having a kiss him? I, I can't believe I'm doing this. He's, it's Beetlejuice, I don't know. <laughs> now, he's it, gross. He, what'd you say? He's gross. Really, you think he's gross? And he's got like one tooth. And... I know, and I'm supposed to pretend I'm in love with him. Think you're gonna be able to do that? Yeah, I can do that. I'm Christy. I'm here because I would like a cut from my husband's CD to be played on the air. And in order to win that prize, I am agreeing to make out with Beetlejuice, which I hope I can do successfully. Now, you know you're competing against another girl. Yes. Okay. How, what do you think your chances are? Are you going to make them believe that you're in love with Beetlejuice? I'm, I think I can, yes. I think I can do it. You think you can do it? Sure. What are you going to do? What's going to be your technique? Well, I can see the adorable part of him, and I can entice him a little and see if he wants to be playful with me and, you know, flatter him, and we'll see what happens. And uh, what do you think of Beetlejuice? Um... It's, he's pretty cool because he obviously was born with deficiencies and yet look where he is. He's just such a example of, you know, you can get from one place to another when you seemingly have a life that is not good, but he is doing so great. It's, but it's but you've seen what he looks like, right? Oh, you mean physically? Yeah, physically. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, you've seen that he has it's one hard. Tooth, right? It's hard. He is not like the normal human being. It's difficult. But if you look past that, he's such a cute little thing. He's wonderful. What do you think making out with Beetlejuice is going to be like? Um, I'm just thinking they rolled him out of bed and he hasn't brushed his teeth and he's going to be slobbery and I'm going to have to have a tissue ready to wipe my lipstick off all of his face. <laughs> how long do you think you'll be able to make out with him for? Um, depends on how long I can keep from swallowing, but <laughs> um, whatever, a good amount of time, a good minute or so. So, Beat, what's going on today? I don't know, brother. Well, aren't, you, aren't you here to make out with some girls? Oh, uh, they wanted to. If they wanted to, that's stuff. That's their th that's their choice. You like making they, out with girls, right? Oh no, that's their choice, not my choice. But you want to make out with them? Oh no, no, that's their choice. Not my choice. Yeah? Have you have you been brushing your teeth lately? Me? Nah, I got smelly brush, man. I smell like fucking sardines, bro. <laughs> you ready to kiss these girls? I don't know. They want to. They, they ask for it. You like girls, right? Oh, not much. You, you well, I ain't gay. So why you don't like girls? I'm not like that. <laughs> you know what? So you know what's going on today, right? Me? Nah. The girls are supposed to make out with you to win a prize. They try. Yeah. They lose. They lose. No. Great Beetlejuice is coming in uh, today. We have two women who are going to compete to see who can make out with Beetlejuice more enthusiastically. The winner will get the prize of their dreams. And here he is, ladies and gentlemen, dressed in Christmas outfit, is the great Beetlejuice, who... One of Santa's helpers. One of Santa's helpers. He's wearing Santa hat, and he's wearing a kind of a court jester outfit with green and red and all the festive colors. Beetle, you're really in the uh, Christmas spirit. It's great to see after the attacks of September 11th, uh, you put cheer into everyone's heart, don't you? Sure, I do. Yeah. Beetle, do you know what's going on today? Did anybody uh, inform you? Uh, nah. All right, let me tell you because I think you're going to like this. There are two women who are going to come in here today. They both want huge presents for Christmas. One of them wants breast implants. I don't even know what the other one wants. But we told them we'd make their dream come true. Whoever makes out with Beetlejuice better. So you, your job today is to make out with these two women. Sure. You like that? <laughs> no problem. All right. We're going to see what happens. Does he understand make out? What is making out? That's me making love. That's me oh, making out. Wow. Yeah. Okay. All right. You know, kissing and stuff. Oh, something like that. Right. 
Yeah. We're smelling sardines. What? Would you say that? <laughs> Would you say that, beat about sardines? <laughs> you devil. They're smelly like sardines, these girls, huh? Oh, you know. Yeah. He says, you said something like kissing. He said, we're smelling sardines. Yeah. Hey, Beetle, uh, yeah, I don't mean kissing the, sm- the sardine smell. Uh, and Beetle, uh, you haven't brushed your teeth today, have you? Me? No. Good, okay. Never do. Hey, Beetle, uh, what have you been up to lately, by the way, before we start this incredible uh, contest? I've been doing a couple of things. Yeah. What have you been up to? Movies, uh, television appearances? What have you been doing? Working. Working, working nonstop. What do you do? A lot of club appearances? Something like that. Yeah. Working what, on the computers or something. Doing a new stand-up? You're doing the computer thing. No. Yeah. You're into computers now? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't know you were into computers. What do you do on that computer? Making all kinds of things. No. Yeah. What? Christmas cards, this kind of thing? Something like that. Yeah. All right. Well, that's your hobby, I guess, computers. Are you ever on those chat lines? Could be, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Chatting with people, finding out what's what? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Listen, uh, Beetlejuice, it's time. Now, I understand you want to eat sardines before you make out with the girls? Oh, I'm sure, yeah. All right. I, didn't, I, I see you were, uh, ta- you were talking about that before. I didn't understand. Yeah. All right. Let's bring in the sardines. I understand they smell horribly. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I see you eat them out there instead of eating them in here. Well, go ahead. You can eat them right here. I don't care. Got a nice big plate. There's a nice big plate. You, you like, like sardines? sardines? <laughs> it's been a rough couple of days for kids. <laughs> it's too rough for you guys. Do you like sardines? Oh, yeah. Yeah, all right. Go ahead. Eat a couple if you want to. I mean, the girls are going to be if smelling If you must. Them. Oh, maybe. All right. Go ahead and uh, eat a few there. Oh, eat. <laughs> I eat them, though. All right. Enjoy. <laughs> they look good. <laughs> I eat them, though. How is it? It's great. <laughs> it's so Beetle just uh, ate a, a nice hit of sardines. Yeah. Is that enough for you, Beetle, or you want more? I'll have it later. <laughs> Bring on the girls, right, Beetle? We were going to use those sardines for the Christmas party, but <laughs> better for you. Anyway, uh, let's meet the girls. I don't know if we're bringing them in one at a time. Yeah, one at a time. One at a time. This is uh, the first girl up is Christy. What she wants to win, she doesn't want to win breast implants. She wants to win, and this is uh, quite noble of her. Her husband has a rock band, and she wants the chance to play her husband's Bands record here You're on the air. Kidding! That's all she wants. That's what she wants. Do now, that's all I want. <laughs> that's all she wants for Christmas. Christy, uh, you're an attractive girl. You got a very nice face. Your boobies look nice. What are you wearing there? Uh, yeah. And I understand you're pregnant. Yes. You're Five months. Five months pregnant, and you're going to make out with Beetlejuice. Absolutely. Could you don't think that'll the scar the baby? Yeah, it could affect yeah. the child. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, have you seen Beetlejuice on TV? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Are you attracted to him at all? Yes, he's absolutely adorable. Well, that's nice. She likes you. Thank you. And, <laughs> and Beetle, do you like her? Oh, yeah. I'm a small in the sardine, baby. Right. And uh, he just ate sardines to make your plight even worse. This is a real contest. It's a game. Now, Christy, this is a subjective contest. There are judges involved. Robin Quivers, myself, Artie Lang, and Fred Norris. The four of us will judge who makes out with Beetlejuice better. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for, but I think I'm looking for passion. We'll know it when we see it. What are you looking for, Robin? I'm looking for commitment. Like, they're really into it. Uh Not any of this, you know, uh, uh. Artie, what are you looking for? Tentative stuff. I'm looking for one of these chicks to maybe actually use their hand on Beetle. Really? You want them to go that far? Yeah. And what about you, Fred? What are you looking for? I'm looking for something to get me excited. Okay. Well, here we go. I have to say that Christy's an attractive girl. Uh, She's sitting down on our couch. Beetle, I think this is your opportunity. Beetle, I know you're in a committed relationship with Katie Juice, but uh, I don't think she'll mind this. They swing, I think. I think they swing. (laughs) What about you? Does your husband mind you uh, kissing Beetlejuice? No, not at all. Are you uh, swingers? Oh, just maybe to some extent, but not... What do you mean, to some extent? Well, he makes a joke that the marriage has a... The door isn't open, it's a jar. (laughs) Oh, he screws around with other broads and you... No, well, we have, you know, there's certain things are sacred or you can't have intimacy. Oh, Oral sex and intercourse, forget it. We would not ever do that with anybody else. But in other words, if I was to go out with you, you might use your hand on me and yeah. uh, make out with me and stuff? Yeah, let's spice up life a little bit with that kind of stuff, sure. Let me really? tell you something. I think that's the only way a marriage can last. I'm serious. I hate to say it, but it's true. And they're having a child. Oh, they're going to bring a kid into this, sure, <laughs> into this mess. Now, Beetle, you got to be enjoying this, a little make-out session, huh? Oh, sure I do. All right, um, well... Let's begin the contest, Christy. I wish you luck. How are 30 um, seconds, right? 30 yeah. seconds? 
Uh, I think that uh, the 30 seconds would be enough of that. Certainly. Beetle, you have a big smile on your face. I think you hey, like this. Don't worry. Is it? Don't worry. Don't worry. I'll do the play-by-play. Play. Don't worry. <laughs> this is called retention. Hey, I'll, I'll talk softly. Christy is now putting her hand down Beetle's shirt and wow. touching his chest. She's grabbing his hand and putting it on her breast. <gasps> She had oh, both man. his hands on her breast, and now she's going in to kiss him. Oh. She's holding his head. Oh my God! And making oh out with him. God. Yeah. Oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> How much time is left? She, she is grabbing Beetle's uh, most intimate of areas. And now is time up. Ten seconds. ten seconds more. Yes, oh, that's ten <laughs> seconds too much. <laughs> she had made a full commitment. Wow, this is so so Yeah, and Beetle. Oh! She is oh! making out with Beetle open mouth. Oh! Done. 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 Time up. Oh my God. Wow. Let me interview a Beetle first. Beetle, how was she? Hey, it was great. It was great. <laughs> you love that. Hey, when he's come up to it, yeah, it's great. Yeah. Are you excited? Oh, always excited, bro. I got to say You liked her. She was good. Christy, I haven't seen the other girl, uh, Sarah, go yet, but, man, you made the full commitment. I'll tell you what. There's, there's no way the other girl can win. I there's know. no way. How do you know? How do you know? Because, because she, she, look, Robert, she laid him down. She was. She had her mouth open as wide as humanly possible. Yeah, she and, was fully and, committed. And, I understand that, she, but she there's committed. another girl, and you know what? another woman in the way. Here's the best wings. part. Here's yeah. the best part. She didn't look repulsed. You know what I mean? She like oh, she no, was. Look she, at him, little chunk of chocolate. I mean, she was oh, there for him. him. Yeah, Christy. How could you be repulsed? Christy, you love How was Beetlejuice. That kiss? It was it was. It, what about the sardines? Was that a problem? I, I'm a Pisces. I love fish. I, it was uh, great. Oh I, man! Wow, you're a very <laughs> loving woman. I'll tell you. I can't get a chick like that to kiss me. I know. Is the baby? I'll kicking take you up to it. You're is, right. Man. Is, yeah, yeah. The baby is. <laughs> the baby is kicking. Going through it. I bet. <laughs> a genetic uh, change. Yeah, trying to get out. <laughs> kicking I gotta get out of here. Get me into another mother. Uh, uh, the thing is, the sardine smell is so strong. Yeah. It's, oh. it's, you can totally smell it. I'm disgusting. Well, Beetle, your uh, job now is to make I, out. Your job now is to. To make out with another girl. Oh, sure. Are you up to it? Sure, I will. Are you up to it? I'm up to it. All right. Are you man enough? Oh, nah. I'm a man up to it. All right. Um, <laughs> by the way, when you when you when you groped uh, Beetlejuice, I saw your hand go there. Uh, was he normal size? Uh, it was hard to tell through this Christmas outfit, but it seemed. Uh, did he seem excited? Yeah. Did he seem decide. excited? Um, getting there. Yeah, all right, Beetle. <laughs> you know what? I'd give somebody a prize to make out with her right now. <laughs> That's how into it she was. Yeah. All right, so let's uh, let's remove uh, Christy from the couch. Good job, Christy. Attractive woman. I mean, yes, her body is distorted from pregnancy, but the face is beautiful. And, wow. Uh, He's got to meet his laws. Hey. hey, Beetle, she's not bad looking, huh? Oh, she's not bad. She's no. not bad. All and right. she's a good kisser? Well, she, oh, yeah, she, she's all right. She's all right. Okay. okay. Here comes Sarah to make out with you. This okay. is Sarah. Sarah is very cute and a nice body, too. Beetle, look at this one. <laughs> it's your lucky day. <laughs> hey, now, this is my lucky day. <laughs> why are you acting so uh, blasé about this? Because I'm a man. That's what I do. Right. right. You're That's cool. Why. You're cool. You're cool. You're cool. That's right. Sarah, let me understand your story here. You want breast implants very badly. Yes. I mean, so badly yeah. that you and Beetlejuice are going to have a makeout session. <laughs> yes. All right. I'm not going to. I don't know if you heard the other makeout session, but it was quite spectacular. Um, in yes. order to uh, now, this is a subjective kind of thing. All right. Uh, the judges are Robin, myself, Artie, and Fred. And we might as well tell her there's a high mark she's got to reach because yeah. this girl went for it. That's right. Now uh, you know Beetlejuice. You've seen him on TV, I su suppose. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Are you looking forward to the makeout session? Yes. You are. Oh. <laughs> you, you're, 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 your mouth says yes, but your face does not say that. Now, Dr. Sal Calabro would perform your breast surgery. I'm looking at your chest. It doesn't look unattractive. It looks like you got some boobage going on there. Do you? They're small. She could they use are more. small. She's cute. She could use more. Yeah. yeah. And how old a woman are you? 21. 21. What does she want to do with those boobs? I guess she wants to go up to a D. Do you want to go to a D or a C? A C. A C. What are you now, an A? A B. You're a B. I don't know. I'd be happy with a B. I'd skip the uh, yeah, makeout session. Uh, uh, no, she could, it would, having a little bit bigger would make her just be perfect. She'd be really hot with, with breast yeah. implants. Yeah. Are you aware that uh, Beetlejuice just ate sardines? No. All right. Well, that's well, part of are. it. Yeah. There you go. Uh, I don't know if you heard the other girl go, did you? No. Very convincing. Unbelievable. Great. She wants to get her husband's record played. That's her dream come true. She doesn't want breast Apparently implants. Apparently, she really wanted it. Yeah. 
Well, uh, we're going to watch you. I'll tell you what, Robin, what are you looking for when you uh, look at this makeout session? Once again, I'm looking for a woman, as Gary said, not to look repulsed, but to really be into, like, she's making out Beetlejuice as the love of her life. I see. And, Artie, what are you looking for? Uh, again, I'm looking for someone maybe to actually finish this whole process. <laughs> <laughs> it's a 30-second time limit. What do you want to see in that 30 seconds, Fred? I want to see this girl go for it, because the other one was great. She's going to have or to. not, she was great. She might have All to right. finish him off to win. <laughs> well, uh, I wish you luck. You must want breast implants very badly. What about getting a job to pay for the uh, breast oh, implants? Why would you do that? Wouldn't that be easier? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do you work? Do, are you presently working? Uh, not really. No? What do you do? I mean, what do you well, do all day? I was bartending, and uh, I dance occasionally. A stripper? Mm -hmm. I see. So she's you, looking uh, to make more money as a stripper. I see. So that would help your career. She gets her boobs. She's going to double her paycheck. Be uh, Beetle, I don't know about you, but uh, every man has his own flavor. Are you attracted to this woman? Oh, sure. I sure. find her attractive. Sure, though. Yeah. And uh, you're prepared to make out again, or is it too much? Oh, for you? yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. You don't care. That was just a, a, an oh, yeah. appetizer. I'm a man. That's what I do. That was a four spice. <laughs> All right, Beetle, uh, I'm going to turn you over to the beautiful Sarah. Sarah, are you ready to go away for, get, Go away with uh, Beetle and uh, go into ecstasy with him? Yes. You are? All right. Yes. There's, you, you don't want to back out? No. There is a 30-second time limit. Okay. Here we go. Sarah and Beetle, I'll do the play-by-play. -play. Go ahead. Sarah's moving closer to Beetle. She's, oh, standing, she's standing up. up. Interesting approach. She's actually oh, giving a lap oh, dance to oh, Beetle. Oh, she's gotten oh, on top. Oh, oh, my oh, God. Oh. She is on top of Beetle. She she's is riding him, around. writhing up. Oh down. She's taking her top oh, off. Oh, she's oh, undressed. Oh my God. Beetle is kissing her all yeah. over her body. The making out, I believe. Is there making out, Robin? Yes, yes. It's a very, oh, my God. God. It is unreal. She is uh -oh. semi-nude. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. She Beetle's in ecstasy. Beetle is in ecstasy. She is rubbing against Beetle like crazy. It is amazing. What how much time is left? Time is up. Time is up. Whoa. I like it. You like that? I, like, I love it. You love it. Beetle is yeah. prone in the chair. Did Beetle. Beetle. Let me ask you something. Sit up, again, yeah. Beetle. Sit up, Beetle. Yeah, yeah, sure. That was unbelievable. So what was up? Uh who did you like better? Mm-hmm. Which one did you <laughs> It's better. You like this one better? Oh, I like both of them. You like both of them. But, but if you had to choose one. If you had to choose one, which would you choose? Uh, I think I'd choose the other one. The other really? one? Really? Oh, Why wow. is that? <laughs> wow. Hello, Beetle. She did what is it, Stuttering John? You know, I was going to say, Howard, from Watch from the Monitor, that the other girl was really, like, her tongue was all inside Beetle's yeah. mouth, like a lot more than this one. Yeah, but really? This chick, this chick took her top oh off and was goodness. riding him. Yeah. And John, John rubbing up point. against yeah. him. Yeah. The other girl had her whole mouth inside Beetle's. Yeah, her <laughs> head was inside Beetle's. Case, were they making out? Yeah, it, there was tongue going on. And this, yeah. this bro doesn't eat implants. She's got nice yeah. cans. Yeah. Yeah. Really? I didn't no, see no, him, she could, but... she could lose them a little bit bigger. No. Just a tiny bit. It's not a question but, of whether she needs them or not. She wants them, and she's here to play for them. Howard, didn't you think that Didn't you think that right before you said go, she seemed very hesitant? And then also it was like she got shot out of a Rocket. This girl did a lot. I'm gonna. Uh, why don't we bring the other girl in and have right, a final have vote? Have our votes. All right, let them both boy, be in oh here. Boy. I think there should be like a 10 second overtime with sudden a death runoff. Type of thing. Right? Yeah. Maybe there should be a runoff. Well, in the event of a tie, we're gonna have to have a runoff. But yeah, uh, the, yeah sure. And Beetle says sure. He's ready. <laughs> Beetle, you oh, seem yeah, to yeah, sure. you loved it. It almost looked like Sarah had raped you. Yeah. I, I liked her aggressiveness. I oh, did. Oh, I love the Christmas. I love that. See, if I had to say one thing, Howard, yeah. it's that Sarah has done some dancing before, whereas the other girl just seemed so real. Like, she really, really liked him. Sarah well, let's have anyone. everybody yeah, get their I'm vote. Yeah, I'm just going by Beatles' face, though. Yeah. Yeah. Beatles right. was in ecstasy. The four judges are myself, Robin, Fred, and Artie. And while the rest of you can talk all you want, we will be the final all judge. Right. Um, Christy, I told you you did a great job. And Sarah, that's your competition, Christy. You did a great job as well. Yeah, it was certainly amazing. Sarah, right. Sarah, no problem with the sardine breath? That was okay? Yeah, that was fine. <laughs> she looks a little shocked. Yeah, it's fine. You're like somebody went from Vietnam. <laughs> she's in shock. She's afraid to talk. Right. Beetle, you like this contest? Oh, yeah, sure. sure. We can do this any time. Love, love this contest. Okay. <laughs> well, I'll go first if you want. Go ahead. All right. I thought Christy and Sarah both did a great job. Christy did have her tongue in Beetle's mouth firmly. It was uh, really something. But uh, what I liked was the aggressiveness of Sarah. This is very hard to choose, by the way. You're both very brave women. Yes. Um, I think our guys in Afghanistan are brave, but you're much braver. <laughs> uh, Sarah uh, took down the chop. That got extra mm. points for me, although Christy did allow Beetle to uh, feel them, although Beetle was feeling Sarah as well. 
Um, I, I like the idea that Sarah got down on her knees and was rubbing against Beetlejuice and very aggressive with her whole body and yeah, kissing Beetle. Yeah, it was Beetle. full body, yeah. She met the makeout criteria. I'm, I'm going to give it to Sarah, uh, right. my vote. And, Christy, that doesn't mean you didn't do a great job. All right. Who do you vote for, Rob? Uh, you want me next? Yes, I do. All right. I have to agree with you. I thought, I thought Christy was unbeatable so when did I. I first saw her. <clears throat> Go for it. Yeah. But Sarah really. Girl number she two. Was, yeah, she was into it. Full body. Okay. And Beatles full body. Let's see what uh, Artie says. Artie, go ahead. Uh, you know what? Sarah was amazing with the, the whole lap dance thing, and she looks like she's an experienced yeah. lap dancer, which I respect like crazy. Right. But uh, the first chick, Christy. The tongue, the, the, that that last ah, tongue ah. effort. When she was, on his lip, was unbelievable. Yeah, she just she swallowed his head. <laughs> <laughs> she got in there with that tongue, and that is really. I mean, that's a good wife. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. All right. So I go with Christy, man. All right. All right. So now it's two to one, Fred. You're the deciding factor. I tell you, I, I I'm going with Christy. Wow, it's a tie. And, and, and I'll tell you why. Because at the end, it looked like Sarah was kind of like pulling back, like she kind of went out of the moment. It's like Christy was committed the entire Don't week. Don't forget, before. Fred, that Christy did uh, stop uh, 10 seconds early. And, and then had to go back. That's yeah. right. There was something about the expression on it. I wouldn't mind if they had a 10-second runoff. Yeah, just yeah. To... Well, obviously, we have All a tie. Right. All right. Well, girls, I'm sorry to say, or what can I tell you, uh, <laughs> it's time for the runoff. Uh, I'm going to give each girl 10 seconds. Casey, watch the watch. I'm going to first let Sarah. Beetle, are you ready for this? You're going to have to make out some more. Oh, yeah. You like it, but... uh... Beetle, this is the greatest day of your life. Oh, it is. Yes. Merry Christmas. It. Merry Christmas, Beetlejuice. <laughs> Sarah, I hate to do it to you. Uh, Christy, I hate to do it to you, but it is a genuine uh, tie. In the event that you tie again, I will bring in a fifth judge who will be... Let me th- let me pick someone randomly. Would you? Would you? <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Are we bring in Would you? Oh, my. There you go. Where is Would Woody's off today. Oh, he's off. Oh, okay. oh then, then maybe Casey, because he's the referee. He's All right, right Casey, there. I'll yeah. let you have the vote, let because have already, because Gary's already made his opinions known, so is Stuttering John. Okay, so Casey, you will be the judge. I'm going to give Sarah the first shot at this. Um, Christy, you could sit there. No, Christy, stay there. You could stay there. <laughs> Sarah, you got 10 seconds. Impress the judges. Okay. Beetlejuice, get ready with Sarah. <laughs> okay. Sarah, go. Once again, she takes the same approach. She's oh, making oh, out with him heavily. Really? She is right in there. She's grabbing, oh, oh, grabbing. Oh, 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 she, her hand has roamed below. Peter oh, 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 grabbing her ass. She's making out vigorously. Done. She's done. 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 Time. Time. Oh. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, he, oh, wanna, he won't let go, Howard. No, he won't. He he might, <laughs> look at the condition of him. <laughs> oh, no. I love it. You love that. Oh, you I love, love it. You love her. Would you oh, marry yeah. her? Would you marry her? <laughs> Could be. Could be, yeah. Yeah, he's still holding out his eyes. <laughs> Christy. Uh, he wants to play the happy. field. Yeah. Christy, this is a tough act to follow, I know, and you're pregnant. And, I'm uh, up for it. He's adorable. Yeah. Wow. And, uh, well, let's see. You seem to really love the Beatle, man. Uh, Sarah, good job. Thank you. All right. All right. I'll do the play by play. Christy, go, go ahead. Christy, pulling up her shirt, putting her hands, taking Beatle's hand, oh, and putting wow. it on her chest. <laughs> She's vigorously sucking face with Beetlejuice, touching him, rubbing him. Making out, grabbing his hey nanny nano. His hands are stop time. Oh my goodness! This is so disturbing. I'm going to go right to the voting. Christy, great job. Sarah, great job. This is a beetle. Are you all right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> beetle, I ask you again. Which girl do you like better? Probably this one. Christy. Wow. Really? Wow, Christy. Sarah though did a good job though. Thank you. Right. Sarah's amazing. See, if one of them brought the other chick into it, <laughs> mm, that, that would have been the. Yeah. Hey, you're <laughs> not the guy right. performing. Hey, you know I didn't think of that. <laughs> I'm saying one of you's got an instant yeah, win good. if you just got the other chick involved. <laughs> All right, let's go to Robin Quivers quickly. Robin, your vote. Jeez, this I'm switching my vote to Christy this time. You are. Yeah, Christy seems to really love Beetlejuice. Wow. Man. I like Sarah's aggressiveness when she gets on top of Beetlejuice and grinds into him and That's grabs his head too. and makes out of him. And every time afterwards, Beetlejuice looks like he's just been through a train he, wreck. He, it looks like he's about to faint. Uh, uh, I like Sarah's aggressiveness, and I'm going to stay with Sarah on this. All right. I'm staying with Sarah. It's 1-1. One, one. Go ahead. Artie? Uh, based on Beetlejuice's look of ecstasy after Sarah, I mean, Sa- I mean, as great as Christy is, and I'll play your husband's CD in my car after the show. <laughs> but... Uh, and she, 
Sarah was turning me on like crazy riding him. Like All that. right. And so I got to go with I'm changing my vote, too. I'm going with wow. Sarah. That Two to one. Point. Fred, you go. I'm sticking with Christy. She did it. Uh, just when I think, you know, she couldn't do any better, she always come, she pulls it out. <laughs> Christy, Christy pulled her shirt up. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's a impressive. very tough decision, and I love uh, Christy's enthusiasm. And That's she true. Lets yeah. you see everything. Well, here you go. It's 2-2. Casey, you have the tiebreaker. I know it's an awkward position for you to be in, but you've been in many awkward positions, <laughs> particularly when you wet your bed and you can't get aroused with your woman. So... You're not a stranger to awkward positions. Uh, Casey, it's your turn to determine who gets the breast implants or her husband's record played. Howard, this is a very difficult decision for me. You were right and up close. Both girls were totally into it with great sports, but I have to go with the unbridled passion of Sarah. Uh, Sarah, the, uh, the second girl. Uh, she went first this time. Sarah, the stripper, who, uh, Christy, I'm sorry you didn't get it. too bad. I'll tell you what I'm going to do for you because I feel bad for you, Christy, and you certainly put yourself through hell and you're pregnant. Uh, what's the name of your husband's band? Loaded Poets. Loaded Poets. Can we hear them on the Internet? If I send my audience to a website, is there, is there a way they can hear them? Loadedpoets.com. There you go. So they'll be hearing the music, yeah. loadedpoets.com. Sarah, you're 21 yeah. years old. How are you feeling? Years. You won you? breast implants from Dr. Sal Calabro, a leading surgeon, who will give you the C cup that you desire. Oh, I think she's crying. I'm like, oh. I'm sp- I'm so excited. Yeah. Well, let me tell you something. You have every right to be. Don't go too big because I, I tell all the girls this. They go too big and then they're, they end up looking like Cyclopses. <laughs> She's going to go stripper big. What is it, uh, Stuttering John? I just think Christy was robbed. You do? Uh, totally robbed. Well, I think well, everyone was honest. Everybody voted the way they saw yeah, it, Yeah, but... He, yeah, I know, but no one counted, you know, Beatles vote. He, you know, you know, he said Christy That's both right, times. That's right, Beatles voted for me. That's true, he but Beatle that. was That's not true. the judge. Well, but he, he he's the was, one in, he, involved in it, you know. John, the judge's decision. Is I know, final. but Audie based his decision on 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 Beatles reaction. But yet, Beatles was the one who said that it was Christie. John, we're, USB, we you, were that, looking. John, so, listen. Both these girls are winners. It was close. It's difficult. We John, just had to pick it was one. A tie break. And let's be honest. If you ask Beatles who he liked fifty times, you're going to get fifty different answers. Right. I don't think so. Well, so far, he always picks Christie. Christie every time. He is does. It, it is. It is the action. B, which, which one? Did, which one did you like better? Which one? This one right here. Wow. See? Wow. Spin them around. Back to Christy. <laughs> but it was what the judges saw that counted. Peter, not why how her? She's felt. Cause she's the only one. Oh. Oh. oh my. He's in love. You see, he's into that tongue thing. I might have to listen to her husband's CD, too. <laughs> well, on the phone is Dr. Calabro. Dr. Calabro, who you can see on SalCalabro.com. You can see all his before and after pictures. Uh, Dr. Calabro, uh, say hi to Sarah. You'll be working on her. Hi, Sarah. How does she look, Howard? Uh, she's a beautiful girl. She uh, really went all out for Beetlejuice. She was, oh. she was just all over him. And uh, I, I believe that uh, she did deserve the win, but uh, there's Great. a lot of controversy in the studio. How's the rest of her figure look? How's the rest of your figure? Stand up for a second. Let's take she's a look. Very thin. Thin. She's good. How's your ass? Let me see what she's. Oh, she looks nice. Yeah. I don't think that she needs implants. I don't either. No, she doesn't need them. She, she doesn't. Need she them. didn't look like she needed it. with the shirt on. It looks like she needs it, but with the shirt off, it doesn't look. Sarah, like let me see your boobs for a second, if you don't mind. Let me see them. Let me see those. Thanks. Yeah, they're tiny. They're, they're not that tiny. They're, they're sweet. They're little. They're in proportion. I know the nuts. problem. They're in proportion to the rest of her body. Yeah. She you looks good. She sounds like she's better things. with smaller implants. Yeah, Dr. Calabro, don't go too big yeah, on her. Yeah, she says oh, she only no, wants no. to be a C. Yeah, C. Talk she, to Sarah because, you know, they put a lot of pressure on me. All right, Sarah, don't go more than a C. That's all I want. All right, good. All right. That's a trend now, too, smaller implants. Yeah. I'm getting very small ones for myself. <laughs> Dr. Calabro, thank you so much. Go uh, to sal- salcalabro.com. Thanks, Dr. Calabro. Uh, Girls, I want to thank you. I think job. you all that did was well. Amazing. Beetlejuice, you owe me big time. I owe you big time. Dude. You do. You do. You don't do. worry. I'll get you. Don't worry. All right. You take care of me, will you? Don't worry. I'll take care of you. Don't forget who your bro is. Who's your bro? You are. Right. Don't forget your bro. I won't forget you. You know, bro, ho, ho. Merry bro in the hose. Bro in the hose. Bro in the nose. Bros in the head. In the West. Wow. No hey, West Cape. I'll tell you what. Bros in the West. Bros in the West. <laughs> right. I mean, that's what I always say. How'd you like that contest? Oh, it's great, man. Dude, you had two hot chicks making out with you. Good. How do you feel I love about it. that? I'll, oh, I love it. <laughs> Christy, what right. are you doing? Well... I don't know how sloppily he ate the sardines, but they seem to be kind of on the outside of me here. His mouth tasted okay, but it was as if he 
was coated in the sun. What did you guys rub them on his face or something? And uh, you want to do that contest again? Uh, not another time I do it. And which girl did you feel was better? Maybe the the blonde. You thought the blonde one was better? The one with the one that's red. Oh, the Christy. Right. You thought Christy was better? I think so. Why? Tell me why. She's the only one. She has a she has a band, you know. All right. You know what I mean? All right, Beetlejuice. Why don't you say goodbye? I can I go to the bathroom first? What are you going to the bathroom for? <laughs> Can I get to the bathroom first, please? <laughs> Is anybody in here? Come on, my ma I like sardines. What's the matter, sir? It's like sardines all in my mouth. Why do you gotta wash your mouth? Because I can't be hungry. I'm putting soup in my mouth. That's so terrible. Now. It still feels gross. I need a toothbrush. Desperately. No, I'm gonna go get some uh, eye mouthwash. You have mouthwash? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, I'm sorry. Get it. Robin, that was terrible. <laughs> oh. That was so terrible. Oh my I God. almost threw up. Like, I was kissing him the way. The reason why I pulled off at the uh, end uh, is because Robin, I had it like up in my throat. Oh, I was like, no. And I'm like, I'm going to puke all over people. He said, it's going to be on camera. <laughs> oh, it was terrible. So you won the implant. Yes. Was it worth it? Yes. What? Yes. Now, what, what was your idea? Like, why were you so aggressive with Beetlejuice? Did you think you had to be super aggressive to win? Yes. Definitely. I just went in, went for it. It was terrible, but I did it. And what was it like making out with Beetlejuice? It was disgusting. It was probably the grossest thing I've ever done. Really? Yes, definitely. Will, will you ever be able to kiss somebody again? Of course. Will anybody ever want to kiss you again? <laughs> I don't know about that.